Okay, my name's Yvonne and I live in a yard where we have a pond, there you go, and pipes. And as you can see, if the quality is good, you see this one's running good and this one's the uh, one I got unclogged with my homemade um, electric snake, plumbing snake. And you can see this one, and not it's coming out but not that strong. So there's that one, and there's that one. All right. So now I'm gonna show you the electric plumbing snake I made for around 30 bucks, and versus the one uh, pl plumbing electric snake that you can get at the hardware store for like 500, which is ridiculous. Okay. Here's the pipe. Oh, oh. Whole whole 60 feet. I mean, that's how long the pipes are from the pond to the creek, because it runs to the creek and stuff. And here is the electric snake part. Pretty. I thought if if maybe it would work and it actually does so now I'm gonna try to videotape and show you that it does work okay remember the left side was unclogged wait a minute actually I gotta unclog that I mean switch the pipe to the clog side once again sorry the camera's shaky and what I did is I put a lot of screws in there kind of like um, in a spiral form so it'll get that stuff up now here's the clogged one and this is the unclogged now I'm gonna stick it in. I'm just gonna get it in there a little bit. So it kind of forces it in. It's kind of forced in there and that won't get un unstuck. Now, I'm gonna go back. And I have, um, like I said, the creek and the pond are like 50 feet away from each other, so I had to buy. 60 feet just to be safe but anyway I'm just gonna stop talking and I'm gonna show you the awesome electric snake now and yes I am dumb for having a cord in the freaking water but whatever alright so set this thing to throw it forward Dang it. Oh man, I'm so unprepared. And here's a thing for you. I already had this thing break once because it was twisted and stuff. You want to have it relatively straight like this going into the pipe so it will just turn and have no tension on it because that's what happened before but it's an easy cheap fix only a dollar to fix so not that bad alright now finally alright here it goes. Camel said reverse. See how I'm going in? Camel said back. It's 
slowly moving in there. Okay, now reverse. Okay, that thing is not good. Okay. Something got caught on it, so I'm gonna un undo it. But, it is so un amazing. Oh, shoot, my shoe. Damn. <laughs> oh, shit. Okay, I only have seven minutes. Better make this fast. Thank God I actually thought it, it something broke. But then I thought I made it, so it, it's impossible that it broke. Alright, let's get these out of here. There's no... But as you can see, the water is good, but I'm going to shut up and come on. Let's go back. But as you can see, I'm going to show you where we were and where we are now. Right wherever this tree was, we were just a few minutes ago. And now, if we had enough... Oh, I better find a course so it doesn't get in the water. Okay. Sorry about the shakiness. Set it there. Alright. Now let's get to it. Okay, now actually what I'm going to do is I'm going to set it aside. Okay, thank God, of course, still there. And as you can see, it because of the force and screws I had in, it actually a lot goes into the pipe by itself. But sometimes you just got to force it. All right. Now, should be, oh, damn, five minutes left. Should be almost in. Now that we got tension off. Four minutes left.
Oh, you've got to be fucking kidding me. Okay, well, I'm 